Broadcasting from Oslo, Norway, this is Cruise News Today with Doug Parker. Good morning. Here's your cruise news for Friday, April 21st. Welcome to New York. Beginning this weekend, MSC Cruises will have a ship sailing out of New York City year-round. On Thursday, MSC Meravia arrived at her new home port in Brooklyn. Later this year, a fifth ship, the Magnificia, will be added to that lineup when she begins sailing out of Florida. Now, as for Meravia, her itineraries will include trips to the Bahamas and Bermuda, as well as a handful of voyages to New England and Canada during leaf peeping season. With 19 ships, MSC is currently the third largest cruise line in the world. And Holland America Line has announced its first ever pole to pole grand voyage sailing in January of 25. The 133 day voyage will sail round trip from Fort Lauderdale on the Volendam, visiting 68 ports in 28 different countries. Highlights of this cruise will include four days of scenic cruising in Antarctica, crossing the Arctic Circle to North Cape, transiting the Panama Canal, and sailing the Amazon River. And at the same time, Holland America ship Zyderdam will be operating a 124-day world cruise. The two ships will meet up in Barcelona for a joint overnight call with celebrations involving both vessels. The 133-day pole-to-pole cruise starts at $26,000 per person. Almost fell off the ski lift here. And the 124 night world cruise starts at $25,000 per person. And finally, Carnival Cruise Line and the Turks and Caicos Islands officials marked the grand arrival of a new fire truck donated to the Grand Turk Domestic Fire Services with a ceremony at the Grand Turk Cruise Center yesterday, right there in front of Carnival's Mardi Gras. The city of Miami has also offered to train the island's firefighters on how to operate the vehicle, further enhancing the safety of the Grand Turk Cruise Center visitors and residents. Carnival has been operating at the Grand Turk Cruise Center since 2006. And the photo of the week comes from Jim Baker from Dallas. This is Carnival Breeze sailing in the Gulf of Mexico. You can send your photo to Doug at cruiseradio.net. Remember, all photos are subject to air. And cruise line stocks were down on Thursday. Carnival Corporation down 5%, 9.33. Royal Caribbean down 3.5%, 62.22. And Norwegian down 4.1%, 12.64. From Holman Coughlin, Norway, I probably butchered that, home of the 52 Olympics. They also do some really, uh, I guess, active ski jumping here, right guys? Yeah. Very cool, and our ship's way out there in the distance. I'm Doug Parker with Cruise News Today. Have yourself a great weekend. Cruise News Today is a production of Cruise Radio. Behind-the-scenes content and extras are now available at patreon.com slash cruiseradio.